Hello all! A couple weeks ago you might have seen me play the game Rise of the Village Hero. It's a game inspired by classic RPG games where you get to explore levels, uncover and complete quests, and slay monsters to earn your title. The game has been given to me by the developer himself, and he now asked me to play the demo he created because he made some changes. So we're doing this a little backwards. <laughs> Rise of the Village Hero. New game. Oh yeah, color head. Create a new game. Ricker. Hey there, guy. Hi, Ricker. What are you doing here? I'm leaving. This town is falling apart. Taken over by orcs. What? You can't leave. We need to do something. Me? Oh no. I'm too old for this. Some knights took refugee in the small keep. Before you talk to those two orcs, learn some things. Learn what? I know enough. Equip that shield and sword that you picked up. Watch your health. How do I watch my health? What do you mean? Equip these potions in your belt and drink them when you are wounded. Place them in any of the squares numbered 1 to 6. What about my stamina? Drink one of those yellow potions when you're low on stamina. You won't be able to hit anything if you don't have stamina. Thanks. Don't take me, yeah. Learn some skill points. Press control and add some strength. You look so weak, you won't be able to swing this sword. Add two strength points to your stats. Okay. One, two. Strength. Got it. Okay. Uh, confirm. Now let's pick up what I had to pick up and equip. Got a rusty sword in the chasm. Now we have some health potions and some stamina potions. Oh, wrong button. Let's talk to him some more. I think I'm ready. Yep, go give them hell. I'm leaving. Oh, and he also just actually left. What do we look like? Oh, hello, guy. Let's see. Let's, uh, before we do anything. Oh, I cannot walk further back. Okay. There you have orcs. That must be the head orc. Okay. Talk to him. Hey you! Go away! Why? This is my town. Well, we are rebuilding it and it's not safe to come in. You're not rebuilding it, you're just being a silly orc. Why are you here? You know what? It'll lake your face. I've had enough chatting with you. before we go inside. Maybe on there. You know, it doesn't look like it, unfortunately. Okay, in order to get through, we're gonna have to zoom out so that I can click on the other side of the wall. And I think we should add a bit of health. A bit of health. Oh, an orc spotted us. 
12 damage. Hey, that's better. Oh. Let's stick to here. Oh. There you go. Oh, he dropped cash. Nice. Did you drop anything? Let's add some more health. There you go. A hunter's armor plus defense. Yes, please. Sop potions there. Oh. There are a lot of orcs. Okay. Adds the small potions that we have here. Baby steps, so just only one comes our way. Before we do anything, I should drink some stamina potion. There's something here that I want to take. More potions. Yes, we can never have enough potions. Stamina potions. Very good. This orc had an exclamation mark. Go and grab all the stuff at the back and let's take it away. Merchant's helper. Okay, okay. Wait, who's that? Hey, that's my bow, you thief. Hello there. What are you doing? Let's be civil. Scavenging for the great goblin merchant's conglomerate. Now move along, please. You mean the stuff you stole from our houses? Whoa! Borrowed. With the purpose of getting rich? A smirk emerges from the goblin's horrible bent teeth. Here, let's make a deal. Bring me one of those rusty swords with inscriptions and gems and I will give you all your stuff. How does that sound? Okay, fine. Okay, be on your way now. Trade with goblins, part one. A rusty sword to get your things back. I have a rusty sword. I got the rusty sword. Yes. Great, thanks. Here's your stuff. Thank you. 10 damage. No, not equip both. Okay. Potions. There were goblins there, but I wanna search. See? Potion. And... Boots! Mine. There we go. Do we have more here? Been there. Been to her. Oh, I see... Potions. Yes. Thank you very much. Goblin. <coughs> Keep misclicking every now and then. Alright. Use a big 
health potion, get the cash, another potion. Okay. I've gotten planks of wood and I've gotten a potion. Still, no, can only really talk. This hero civil gave us an opportunity instead of just instantly try to kill us. I don't want all of them to instantly come to me. So what if I Okay. Just slowly step by step. Probably drink some more stamina so that we will never re encounter somebody. We can attack. Potions. See if there's anything in this field. Yes. There's more over there. An archer. Oh. Literally just walk this way and you walk that way. Still feels really unfair. <coughs> Don't know if that one dropped something. Did you drop something? No. Greedy. More potions. Hey, look, pants! Yes! Help that we need. Right, attack him. Drink a potion or two. There you go. Cash and potions. They're 
something there. What is it? Oh, a hunter's cap. There we go. You almost got the entire outfit. Stamina and a health potion. <coughs> Coins. Ooh, what's this? A short weapon, a bit rusted. Damage plus 14. It's more damage. Oh, requires dexterity of one. Luckily, we still have one point. There you go. Yes! Okay, let's walk in here. Have a little conversation with Sir Arthur. Everyone be on your guard. The man stares at you before starting to talk. Hello, guy. I was not expecting to see you here. Hi, Sir Arthur. What in the world has happened here? Where is everyone? Why are you not out there beating these things back? Um. Guy, I have no idea. One moment we were going about our business, and the next we were attacked by these horrible monsters. Okay, so what do we do now? Wanna help? When I went to the church, I heard a lot of noises, so whatever was happening came from there. Okay. Cannot talk to you. Are there the stuffs here? Maybe? No. Potions here, though. Let's take all the potions. Oh, hello. Where is he? What is happening? It can't be. Whisper something to herself. Hello. Sorry, I don't have time to talk just now. Hello. Sorry, can I help in any way? I'm scared. I couldn't find my father. I can look for him. But with everything happening... Thanks, I know. Just if something happens, I hope he can rest at peace knowing I am okay. In front of me, Baroness of Castlelot, Veronica Brent. She is stuck up for sure, all about etiquette and manners, this one. Welcome to our little keep. My name is Veronica Brent. How do you do, my lady? Very good, thank you. All things considered, good to hear you kept your manners and etiquette teachings, even in these horrific times. <laughs> thank you, my lady, I'm glad to hear it. I have arranged for a blacksmith and an apothecary to help with the cause. Thank you, we shall check them out. Accept this generous donation for your help with our troubles, Hunter. And made a good look upon you favorable. Okay. Any stuffs around here? No. Hello. Beatrice's healer shop. I have the cash. We could just buy some extra... Potions. But let's see what he has. I mean, might just be able to find them. And then I spent all that money on it. 
Plus, I also don't necessarily need potions yet, so let's let's not do that. But thank you. I'll come back. I'm sure, I'll need it at a certain point. Okay, going through this wall. The weather is better on this side of the wall. Leveled up. It gave me more health. Oh. Not yet the time to do anything with it. See, Hunter's Gloves. It's a good thing I didn't uh, buy them. Nope. Wrong button. Hello, is anybody here? Hello? Hey, what are you doing here? Ah, uh, peasant. Come hither now, I need thee to take me to the keep. Not a servant, to be ordered about. Excuse yourself for my presence right now. You had best hope I forgive your indiscretion once the situation has been resolved. Now be quick and dispose of these creatures and I shall make my own way back since you are useless. Very well, I shall help you, but not only because I don't want your death on my uh, conscience. How about you learn some matters? Once you have learned some matters and speak to people nicely, then I shall help you. Yep, because dang. How dare you! <laughs> I'll have you punished. I don't care. <laughs> Exclamation mark didn't go away. How are we doing now? Please, I'm sorry, I'm terrified. I will give you anything you like. Look, I have this amulet. I was told that this is magical. Just take it, please, and help me out. I'm sorry for the way I spoke to you. Good girl. That's better. See, that was not that hard. I shall help you. Hopefully you learned your lesson. Yes, yes, I'm a changed person. Now, can we please go? <laughs> Alright. Amulet. It's plus three percent health. Oh. Let's uh, zoom out a little so we have a bit more overview over what might be in the trees. Let's give some more health to oneself. Um, yeah, it doesn't really matter. We're gonna attack all. Oh, magic! <laughs> Closest, so you are gonna go next. We drop something, and we pick that up in a second. There you go. No, I have the same one. Potions. Nothing in the trees. I will be drinking a few of these. Because three at once sure cuts in your health. That's the head orc right there. Maybe check out the other side first before we are trying to uh, attack him. Maybe we can gain another level and become stronger. I mean, I have the points, I should actually use them. Control. I want more strength. Actually, let's leave one just in case we find a weapon and we need to add something. Okay. Yeah. Okay, somebody here. 
here. In front, an old farmer, scared but proud, is defending his farm with a farming fork. Get away, you crazy fiend! Oh, wait a minute, I'm not one of them. I'm simply trying to get to the church. Listen, sir, I appreciate this is your home and you may not wish to leave, but is there anything I can do to make you reconsider? Listen, son, nothing you could say would make me leave my home. Look, sir, we're surrounded by enemies. Orcs and monsters. Could you please reconsider? There is a keep still manned by a few knights. Your assistance could help protect the civilians. I suppose my house will be fine. You're right. I will assist the civilians and endeavor to be of use to the knights. I served in the army before. Thank you, young man. But before I leave, please bring me some wood so I can barricade my house. Then I will go. Luckily, I found wood. Thank you. I shall barricade and be on my own. I shall be on my way to help at the keep. Thank you very much. Done that, done that. Worried daughter, father's lost. Head over to the church and defeat any enemies on the way. Okay. Those are my still open quests. You came from afar. Dang. I come back for the potion. But first, I've gotta get rid of me. Thank you. There's another one there. I can't attack him because there's a gate in the way, so we're gonna have to walk this way first. Then I can click on him to attack. There's a potion here. I see something else there. Another potion. spot anything in the trees that quickly. Uh, let's see, we have potions and we have more potions. Twelve. But that is the same one. Oh, twenty. There you go. That's much better. Not welcome here. Boss says, take head off. Well, shut up, you org. Let me go through it. Could be good food for you guys. <laughs> org leans in to sniff me before making a disgusted face. You don't smell good. Go away. <laughs> okay. Well, then just shut up. Anger is visible on the orc's face and he's ready to attack me. Okay, I eat you now. I thought it didn't smell good. You're strong. I can handle it. Just about. So. There you go. <laughs> Ooh, two big potions. Good. That guy is not doing anything you I can talk to. Okay. Stay alert. Protect churchy building cave. I found you. You shall pay for what you did to my town. No, you will pay you. You angered him. Oops. <laughs> dude, you were much weaker than the other dude that tried to eat me. All of this stuffs. 
16, this is 20. Oh, keep pressing the wrong button. Alright, let's add some health. And that was the demo of Rise of the Village Hero. Thank you for playing my demo. I hope you have enjoyed it. If so, consider wishlisting or purchasing my full game. Stay tuned in the future for more updates. This is not the end of the journey for Guy. Mm, exciting. The demo currently features the first level, which has seen improvements in lighting and overall graphics. I also know that the developer is still busy trying to improve everything by adding more houses to explore, more enemies to kill, and improving the looks of the UI. Hopefully seeing the demo convince you to try it out for yourself or to even buy the game.